We all know, and it's very clear to us, what the first Avera was in the world, the first sin. It was when Chava ate from the Eitzadas and gave it to her husband, Adam, to eat from it also. The whole thing started when Hashem told Adam Arisha that you cannot eat from the Eitzadas, from this tree in Gan Eden. And I'm not sure how the message went over and went through to Chava, but for some odd reason, or she put on herself, or she was told that you should not touch the tree. Even though Hashem said you shouldn't eat from it, but it was added on not to touch it. It was a chumrah. While we all know that we have to put chumras on ourselves, we have to add on onto the mitzvahs to keep it better and stronger. But we have to know what a chumrah is and what the actual mitzvah is. Like the Apostle says initially, that you should not add on to the mitzvah. The mitzvah was given to us in a certain way. Hashem knows how to give it over and exact details and we have to keep those details and it's easy for us to keep it and we'll be able to keep it easily but all the chumras we have to know it's a chumra and then we'll be able to keep it but if we make the chumra as if it's a part of the mitzvah that's when problems might come up like you can see in, in Hilchas Shabbos there are Arv Malachas and there are Toldes there are the main Malachas that Hashem gave us the Lama Tes Malachas which we learn out from uh, the Mishkan and then we add on all the details and sub-details about it but we still call it a Tolda there's Av Malach and Atolda. So when we know straight, clear, and we know for ourselves what the main thing is, what the additional parts are, what the Chumras are, then we'll be able to keep both. Get Shabbos.